coffee is the second leading agricultural commodity in Papua New Guinea after oil palm and contributes substantially to foreign exchange earnings and GDP. The production of coffee employs about 2.5 million people. Between 2012 and 2017, coffee accounted for 26% of total agricultural export, 6% of GDP, and 1% of Welsh production, translating about 450 million kina annually. Coffee is the highest foreign exchange earnings for Papua New Guinea, the majority of which is grown in Eastern Highlands Province, the Western Highlands Province and Simbu province. Production is legally by small farmers with land holdings that grows as little as 20 trees per plot, predominantly in isolated places. The production is mostly certified as organic coffee. However, the process of converting raw coffee beans into the secondary green bean coffee is foremost and yet important process and requires tons of energy. The technique involved in this process is mostly manual, especially the picking and pulping process. Pulping coffee requires a lot of time, energy and labor. There are by far three methods of pulping coffee. The three methods are crushing by hand, manual pulping, motor driven pulping. However, our proposed design was to use the bicycle mechanism and integrate with coffee pulper to give energy efficient, flexible and cheap coffee pulper that maximize output. The process involved in construction. 1. Collecting waste materials, bicycle parts, off-cut irons from construction sites. 2. Patches needed items and materials like welding rods, cutting and grinding wheel, metal drill bead, bolt and nuts, sandpaper, CRC spray, and paint spray. The third step, we grind and cut two dimensions according to our proposed design. After the framework, we apply undercoat painting to the joints. Next process is welding and framework process. Next, we mount coffee pulper onto the design, adjust to flawless alignment. Next, we carried out a first test. Comments on the testing. On the testing, the alignment of the coffee pulper and the pulley wheel along with pulley belt are flawless and we observe that the energy has been maximized. The rotating rate of the proposed design is 200 revolution per minute to 700 revolution per minute. Next up, we did a good polishing up and spray painting and leave it to dry. In conclusion, so we took the design to Gafuku village in Goroka district for the local coffee farmers to see, test and give their feedback. To conclude, According to the coffee farmers in the village, not every community members can afford motor-driven coffee pulper, electricity, source of electricity, or generator for that matter. According to their feedback, our proposed design really helped them and maximize their energy output and save them big time and energy loss. They said the design is simple and yet so very helpful. It's affordable, it's flexible, it's portable, and the most significant and beautiful thing about this design is that it is made out of waste materials.